Hello and welcome back to Alex Goes Sailing. It's the next morning and look how peaceful it is here. There's basically no wind really at all, so it's not a sailing day. Just a nice blue sunny sky, although it is greying up a bit later after lunchtime. This is about nine o'clock, so it's going to be getting a bit greyer later. You can probably see it just over there. I can see the start of the grey cloud. But yeah, uh, nice and sunny and we've got to head over to the marina over there and get the trailer out, get Marikai loaded up onto the trailer and it's almost high tide, so got to get a wriggle on. We are in the middle of the channel. We're coming up on some wake, as you can see. Get a good splash and stuff. But we've got big old ferry coming down the channel and another big container ship coming down. And we've just made it across the channel, almost into the green, there's the green marker there. So yeah, we've come from all the way back there. Even got the head sail up, getting a little bit of more speed. Daniel's been cleaning up the boat and we've got our dock lines ready and just need to get our fenders out and hook those up and we should be good to go. And now I've got to call the marina, get them to open the gate for the slipway and then figure out how I'm getting to shore because I don't have a pass for the pontoon if the pontoon is still there because they said they were going to take it away. So, yeah, this could get interesting. Right, we're in to the handle now. There's the marina, I've just got to go get Brutus onto the slipway and yeah. We're doing three and a half knots and there's a fancy ass looking race boat coming through. Right, just coming off the docks. You can see Daniel's wading in. I've got the remote over here. I've got some dock lines to throw to him. But it's pretty much dead out there and there's not much wind, so we should be all right. And I think it's in deep enough because we're about where the, uh, all the angle meets for those arms is about how deep it needs to be. So I'm gonna put this camera down and focus. How are we looking? Up to my left. Done. The ball. Done. Oh, you're good. How's that? Looking good. Will it go on? I think so. You're well forward now. Well forward? Yeah. The boat's bumping the... What? Uh, okay, we have to go back a bit then. <laughs> yeah? I almost stood on crab. Right. Daniel's walking in crabs. We've got the boat perfectly lined up. You can see we've got the arm there. You can see how shallow it is as well. But we are perfectly lined up and I can pull it up with the remote now. Right, we're back in the boatyard and we've had a drama on the way up. I noticed this valve down here fishing out air. You can see it around the, the neck of the actual valve. It's just worn against the metal probably. Uh, stick the rock on it, stops it a bit, slows it down. But I've got the jack and a bit of wood. I'm just gonna sit it down so that when we strap down the trailer, uh, this one isn't crooked and then leaving all the rest of them at different heights We want to have everything at the same height for when we strap it down. So yeah, I'm gonna jack this up All 
We've got the wood underneath there. Tire still screeching out, but yeah, we'll strap this down. Get the boat packed up. We've still got the mast to take down to pack up the rest of it. So yeah, I got a set of time lapse going. We're gonna get started. <laughs> Got her all loaded up now, ready to go, all strapped down. Um, we did get the flat tire, I just strapped it down. It's pretty much empty now anyway, so uh, useless. We've got the wooden block in there still, so that's good. Got all the straps down. I've added these ones, this is a recent addition. Um, stops the back of the thing jumping up too much and flexing with the front, because that gets it all a little bit unstable, but yeah, all strapped down now. Got the mast up there, and uh, Brutus is ready to go. And leave your comments down below what you thought of this little adventure. There's a lot more to come this season. So thanks for watching and I'll see you guys next time.